I see you've ignored my advice to prepare a stronger defense. Shut up! You won't get past me! I won't let you lay a finger on Master Dominico! Dominico? <laughs> What's so funny? Such a pity that you should die never knowing about your noble origins. I could tell from the start that absurd show-off was not the one. The Scepter is all-knowing. No. I seek the chosen heir of the great sage Koopas, one of the seven who sealed away the Lord of Darkness, Rathorn! And that, David, is you. What a pity that the one who should be protecting you is unaware of his responsibility. I'd have to fight you somewhere along the way. Still, I have to admit I'll be a little sad to watch you die.
helping out. Thank <laughs> you. 
Move! <laughs> Just in the nick of time. The barrier is ready. Yo, villainous fiend! Take my life, would you? You'll have to break through my barrier first! Alakazam! Mastermind. Well done. You did a fine job of keeping her at bay until I was ready. I must reward you. You may have the honor of finishing her off. Do you accept? What? Why on earth not? Explain yourself. Well, well. So, this girl is a friend of yours. And she's been under some kind of curse ever since you defeated the Dual Magus. Oh, hardly a good excuse. But I don't care anymore. The girl is yours to do with as you please. Consider it a reward for attempting to protect my life. There won't be any, um, <clears throat> financial reward, of course. <laughs> Wait. Where's Sir Leopold? He's gone. He must have been scared off by all the disturbance. David, go and find Sir Leopold at once. Y yes, Master. this story from my great-grandmother. She told me how her own great-grandmother was a renowned sage who came from the western continent to be married. A sage? What do you mean? I didn't really understand at first either. But apparently, even though she was a woman, she was a master of sword fighting and magic. Really? So... Maybe that's why you're so good at them too. Maybe it came from her. If only. But I'm not under any illusions. I'm sure there's room for improvement with my sword work. And any real magician would think my magic's just child's play. You think? Well, I can't do either. If you ask me, your magic's amazing. Thanks. But it really isn't. In fact, if you ask me, I wasn't the one who inherited our ancestors' magic. I think it was you, Jessica. I'm sure there are abilities and skills that haven't yet been awakened in you, but one day they will be. And I can't wait to see you when that day comes. Coming to King Trode, Gov, what, what happened? I feel like I've just woken up from a really long dream. Ah, it looks like you're back with us at last. Don't you remember? You disappeared the day after we defeated Dulmagus. Yes, I do remember. But wasn't that all a dream? I was being controlled by a hideous magical force. 
just like Dulmega's was. It was this huge, terrible, evil, magical being. The Lord of Darkness, Rapthorn. But I found some things out. Listen, I've got so much to tell you. But there's no need to rush. Just take your time and start at the beginning. Yes, Rapthorn was ordering me to do things. He told me to seek out and destroy the heirs of the Seven Sages so his seal would be broken. Rapthorn once terrorized the world, and it was the Seven Sages who managed to seal away his soul. They didn't have the power to destroy him completely, but they shut his soul away in the scepter and sealed it with their mystical blood. Rapthorn's curse seeks to destroy those sages' heirs. Master Rylus, my brother Alistair, Abbot Francisco, and the man from Baccarat, too. Everyone who's been killed has been an heir of one of the Seven Sages. Hmm. The plot thickens. Do you mean to say that the reason Medea and I haven't been turned back to normal is also to do with this Rapthorn fellow? I don't know, but there are only three heirs left. David and two others. If the heirs of all seven sages are wiped out, Rapthorn's seal will be broken and he'll escape from the sept... That's it! The scepter! King Trode, where is it? Where's the scepter? <gasps> you, you mean the royal treasure? Come to think of it, I don't know. I lost sight of it in all of the hullabaloo. No! David's in danger. Whoever picks up the scepter will fall under Rapthorn's control. We have to find it. We have to save David. Come on! We must find the scepter before it's too late! <laughs>